has been announced that Messi is leaving PSG at the end of the season. So today, we're going to find him a new club to play for. In this video, every time that Messi scores a goal, he will be forced to transfer to the team that he scores against. Take a good look because this is the last time you will see Messi in a PSG shirt. All right, before we begin on the reel, though, wild that Messi has just announced before the transfer window, before the season's over, that he's leaving. I wanted him to go to MLS so bad, but it's looking like he's going to be going to the Saudi league in real life. All right, let's jump into this brand new career mode and begin the challenge. In this video, we're going to be seeing how many different clubs Messi can transfer to, and then the goal is, at the end of the video, to hopefully have him join a club that will win as many trophies as possible, including the Champions League. Now, here's our first big decision of the video. Should we put PSG in a preseason tournament? Now, the American Challenge Cup, look at these teams. I want to get out of League 1 as soon as possible because if we stay in League 1, he could end up like transferring to a terrible team if he scores against them. So he's officially joined the American Challenge Cup where hopefully Messi scores against one of these teams or maybe even a few. And We'll be moving immediately. Our very first match of the video is against Bayern Munich. If Messi scores, we'll be moving to Germany. And he has not scored. We're staying. Real Madrid and Chelsea are up next. Messi, please score. Here's match two against Madrid. Fingers crossed. Oh, I, I kind of want him to join in Neymar's the only one. Oh, God. He needs to score against Chelsea now or else we will be stuck in France. I guess he won't be stuck, though. Champions League, we could end up moving. But I'd rather not do that. Let's just win or score, I should say, against Chelsea. Oh, it's his first goal, and we're moving to Chelsea, which I don't know if I should celebrate because Chelsea is just god-awful in real life right now. Here's our first of many clubs we'll be moving to Chelsea. We're off to England. But before we can continue, there are two rules I forgot to mention. In this video, I'll be able to skip past five games with no punishment. If Messi scores or if he doesn't score, it won't matter. I can stay on the club that I'm at. But each time I do skip a game, I will have to spin this wheel of punishments as a forfeit. And also, I'm allowed to play five random games if I really want Messi to score and move to a specific team. I can decide to play that game. All right, let's begin Messi's campaign on Chelsea. So weird seeing him in that Chelsea campaign and EA have just jumbled up my formation. Apparently, they want Messi to play in the midfield. I think this game would be fixed by now. How many years has FIFA been out? It's about to end, and they still haven't been able to get career mud right. Look at this. Everyone's out of position. All right, our first game of the season is against Aston Villa. Already had a game that I'd rather Messi not score, and I don't really want to move to Villa, but I'm not going to use my skip just yet. I'm going to try to save those as long as I can, and good thing I did it because Messi did not score. Now, I don't know if I made this clear, but I can choose to use the skips as well after the game is complete. So if Messi scores, I could be like, skip Villa, we're not moving there. Second match of the season against Southampton. I don't plan on being at Chelsea for long. So if we lose, it really doesn't matter. We're gonna end up scoring eventually. Wait, have we scored in this one? We haven't. Not gonna lie, I thought Messi, with him being 90 rated, I thought he'd be scoring like every match. He's not. He's washed. Come on, Messi. I gave you the captain's armband and everything. I guess maybe he just he wants to stay at Chelsea. <laughs> now time for our last game in August against City. Would not mind scoring and moving there. All right, this is a big one. Messi has decreased to 90 overall, so his rating is dropping. Let's see what happens. Oh, my God. He's actually scored. We're moving to City. It's actually happening. This is going to be the third team we'll be joining in this video. And we're joining just in time for the Champions League to begin. Match one with City is against Sevilla. Rather not move there. If we do move there, though, we would potentially get to play against Barcelona and Real Madrid. Messi has scored. Do I use a skip or no? Sevilla is a club I don't want to move to. Let's use one of our five skips. So Messi's allowed to stay at City, but I have to spin this wheel of punishments, which is going to... Punish Messi. What are we starting with? Reduce weak foot. So as you can see, Messi has four star weak foot. And now he has three star weak foot. Our next game, we're back in the Premier League playing Tottenham Hotspur. They kind of need a right winger. So if we score here, I, I wouldn't mind. He has not scored though. It is a 1-1 draw. Foden gets the lone goal. We want to win the Champions League in this video. So as long as I can continue to play for a Champions League team, we're chilling. Back in the Champions League and we're playing a Danish team. Do not want to score here. Moving to the Danish league would be a nightmare. We'd never return. No. Please say he didn't score. Oh, thank God. I would have had to use my second skip if we scored. And with that, we're officially in the month of October where Manchester United is up next. The reason I keep counting months is because if I can make it to January, 
playing for a team with a winning record, all my skips will reset and will go back to five for the second half of the year. And if we keep going at this pace on City, I'm not moving anywhere. City is in 11th place. All right, here we go. How about a little Manchester Derby? United versus City. Will we be moving? We won't. Holland scores two. Holland's literally scoring all the goals for this team. Messi's just, he's just chilling, watching. All right, up next is Fulham. And of course, Messi has scored. Oh, do I really have to move to Fulham? Fulham, should I use a skip? Yeah, I'm spinning the wheel. Yes, I should. I'm just banking on these skips resetting in January. If they don't, I could be in trouble. Is Messi reducing his skill moves now? Bro, reduce skill moves by one. Yep, he had four-star skill moves, and now he drops to three-star skill moves. And to be honest, these two punishments that we've had so far aren't even bad compared to what else is on the wheel. Back in the Champions League, and Borussia Dortmund is up next. Will... I'd be off to Germany. I have a feeling we will be. No! Messi! Oh. Messi's only scoring against the weaker team so far, man. If I was doing this video with Holland, we'd literally be moving every single game. Our next game was against Villa, where Messi didn't score. Game against Chelsea, where Messi didn't score. Believe it or not, Messi went on a goal-scoring drought for the entire month of November until he played Bournemouth. Of course, Messi goes on a streak for that long of not scoring. And then he decides to just score against Bournemouth and he scores two. We have a decision to make here to use our third skip or not. They will reset in January if we're on a team with a winning record, which City is right now. So I think I should just use these two skips right here. Now we kind of have a big decision to make. We need to be on a winning team at the end of December. The Bournemouth is not a winning team. Man City are. Here's our schedule for December. We have three skips left. I'm going to use our third. Messi, please start scoring against good teams so i i don't have to spin this wheel and destroy your stats oh god reduce messi's pace by five all right so messi's currently in 89 overall and i've reduced his sprint speed and acceleration by five each he's still on 89 overall but he now has 68 sprint speed oh god all these games left in december and only two skips remain here we go this is west ham Messi has not scored. Next game in the Champions League against Copenhagen. I'm definitely using a skip if he scores here. Holland scores two. And who scored the first? Holland with the hat trick. Dude, Holland scores every goal for this team. Messi's terrible. Messi's literally just like hiding behind Holland. He doesn't want to leave City. So he's just letting Holland do all the work. Speaking of Holland, he has just won the Ballon d'Or. <laughs> Now our next match is against Leicester City, who's actually above us in the Premier League, so I wouldn't mind scoring here. Holland gets two more goals. Who scored the first? Holland with another hat trick. Can you give this man another Ballon d'Or at this point? We had two more scoreless games against Brighton and Leeds, but now Arsenal is up next. Messi down now to an 88 overall, and here is Arsenal. Will he stay on this scoring drought? I don't know what it is, man. He scores. Oh, I got to move to Arsenal. All right, now I'm not even going to lie. I didn't even look where Arsenal were at in the table before I decided to move here because we could have skipped them, but I I'm just going to accept. I'm assuming they're top 10. Oh, no. They... Oh, God. Villa second. I skipped... Did I skip Villa? Oh, my God. Arsenal might have a losing record. Oh, they're in 11th. Eight wins, seven losses. Okay, they have a winning record, but they still have one more game in December. It's against Manchester United. So if we lose this and Messi does not score, then I don't get any more skips. But if we win this game, we're fine. If we win and Messi scores, then we're also fine because he's going to join Manchester United. All right, there's a lot of scenarios that could happen here. Let's find out. Here it is. 3-1. Oh, no. Messi does not score. Arsenal loses. Worst case scenario, they do not have a winning record. I get no more skips the rest of the video. Of course, it's Arsenal who has to go on and ruin everything for me. But right, the good news is I still had two skips remaining, so we keep those. I, this challenge has just gotten a whole lot harder, though. Nah, stop it. Look who we're playing next. It's Man City. If I have to move right back to Man City as soon as I left. Oh, my God, I do. I, I should have just used the skip on Arsenal. I am so dumb. This is ridiculous. I can't, I can't believe I'm having to do this right now. Back at right wing on City like he never left. I right, know, good news. City topped their group in the Champions League, so our hopes of winning it are still alive. Did I really join as we're playing Manchester United? This I feel like this is like our 10th time playing them this video, and we haven't scored against them yet. Still haven't. John Stone scores, bro. Messi, if you're watching this video, you probably you probably are. M Messi, I'm pretty sure he watches all my videos. Um, 
don't go to City because according to FIFA, you will be terrible there. We're rolling into the month of February and Liverpool is the next opponent. Now, I haven't checked if Liverpool are still in the Champions League. Wouldn't mind though. I feel like they probably are. Wouldn't mind scoring here. Moving to Liverpool. Holland with two. Messi is seriously just hiding behind Holland's long, luscious locks of hair, it seems like. No goals here against the Newcastle United. And now it's time for Bayern Munich in the Champions League. Been in the Premier League for too long, Messi. I demand you to score against Bayern Munich. Please. 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 No. No. Where are my Messi fanboys at? Why is your boy not scoring? What's he doing? Listen, I don't choose sides. I almost just, I almost agree more with that Messi's better than Ronaldo just because Messi won the World Cup. But like, yo, I don't know. I don't know after this. I, I, I can never choose sides. I go back and forth, man. Still a chance to join Bayern Munich. We just have one game in between like two and it's against Chelsea. We already played for Chelsea, right? We'll probably end up scoring here. Moving back. Bernardo scored and Ruben Diaz. So we're down 2-1 on aggregate. This is like two best case scenario Messi scores and Bayern Munich still wins so they stay in the Champions League he scored no that's the worst case scenario he scored and Bayern Munich got eliminated just please just start the sad music my freaking my life is a joke ah uh, he's finally left he is uh, joining Bayern why does he look happy Messi, but take that smile off your face. We need to pause and reassess our scenarios now that we're no longer in the Champions League or Premier League. Good news, Bayern Munich are atop the Bundesliga as I expected. So we're hoping to win that trophy, but this is what we want to see. Borussia Dortmund and Leipzig are still in the Champions League. Oh no, we just played Dortmund one day before I got here, no. All right, we have to simulate to the next month. Who's going to be our next game? Come on. Who is it? Who is it? Oh, it's actually Leipzig. Oh, my God. Messi, I'm speaking to you right now. If there's any game in your entire career that I need you to score a goal in, it is this game right here against Leipzig. Please. Messi, I need a hat trick minimum this game. Put the ball in the back of the net. He's only done on and done it. Come on, Messi. Hopefully, this is the last team who will join, and Leipzig will win the Champions League. So here it is, Leipzig Milan quarterfinals. It's tied 2-2 in aggregate, and we got here just in time for the second leg. So I either need to win and not score or lose and score. Very interesting. Okay, let's just see what happens. Penalty shootout. So penalties do not count. If we make a penalty, it does not count. But did we score in regulation? Leipzig is advancing. Messi. Please don't. I really hope he didn't score. Yes, we're moving on. Let's go. I love how I'm like celebrating that Messi didn't score. I mean, hey, that's the, the point of the video. And we've drawn Napoli in the semifinals of the Champions League, but we have one Bundesliga game in between. This would be the worst way to go out if um, I somehow score in this game and we have to move to Mainz and we don't even get to compete in the Champions League. It would just be the worst. Warner scores. Come on, please say no to Messi. Oh, thank God. All right, the Champions League is all that remains. Okay, so if we score, it's fine. We'll just move to Napoli. We just... Whatever team we score with needs to be the team that wins. So if we score here, we need to lose. We lose and don't score. That is not good. Don't let the video end against Napoli. Leg two. We need, we need to score and lose. Or, I don't know, just something good happen. Leipzig's through. Oh my God, Leipzig's through on penalties. Messi. If Messi scores though, we're, we're out. If it shows a goal by Messi's name, we're done because we have to move to Napoli. Here we go. Oh my God, I hate this so much. Please. I think we're good. I think we're, yeah, he got subbed out. Oh, we're good. We're on to the final. This couldn't be any more dramatic of a video. Look who I'm playing. I've also just realized I still have two skips left and luckily did not have to use them. So here's the catch of this final. I need to win and not score. Because if I win and score, then technically, we're on Manchester City, and we will have lost. Moment of truth, win and don't score. Win and don't score, or lose and score. Either one, we won. Messi scored. No! No, Messi scored! That means, ah. Oh. It means we end on City. I've just been trolled so hard this video. What do you guys think? Is this, is this a dub or an L? Because technically I won the Champions League, but we scored, meaning I had to move with City, which is the club we end on. And City lost the Champions League. You guys need to comment. 
Did I win or lose this challenge? If you guys enjoyed, click watch this video. I know you're going to enjoy it. Subscribe. Let me know what challenge I should do next. Did I win or lose? I don't, I still don't know.